and welcome back to my channel. I hope you are all well. I have such an exciting video coming for you guys today. I've been so excited to film this one. For today's video, I had a browse on Pretty Little Thing and I managed to pick up a few pieces from the Molly May collection. Now, I tried my best to get my hands on absolutely everything for you guys, but unfortunately, the sizes that I needed were out of stock in a few of the items, but I have picked up pretty much everything I could. Before we get into today's video, make sure you go down below and hit the subscribe button. Also, don't forget to head over and follow up my Instagram. I'll pop it on the screen now for you guys. This is where I interact with you guys the most and get you involved in videos. So if you guys want to get involved in future videos, head over there and follow. I just wanted to say a quick thank you to you guys because the support has been immense recently and I have been so overwhelmed. You guys have been absolutely amazing, especially on my last video, which I was so worried about, as you guys know. And you guys just smashed it out of the park. And you guys really seem to love that style of content. So I'll definitely be bringing you some more of that. So without a further ado, let's get into the video. I am so excited to see these pieces in person and also on. I'll be trying them on for you guys so you guys can see the fit of the pieces. So let's get into revealing the Molly May collab with Pretty Little Thing. a massive thank you to Pouch for sponsoring this video. If you guys are unaware as to what Pouch is, Pouch is a free desktop browser extension that searches the web for the best voucher codes and applies them automatically at checkout when you shop online. Pouch has saved me so much time and money without any effort at all. Pouch is super easy to use and does all the work for you. I use Pouch to purchase the clothing items that you will later see in this video at a lower price. As you guys can see, Pouch automatically pops up at checkout. Pouch then searches for the best discount code and applies the best one. Even though Pretty Little Thing are offering 30% off, Pouch gave me an extra 5% off sale items. Whilst using Pouch, I have saved £2.97 on my online order. Pouch works on over 3,000 UK online retailers, which is more than any other similar browser extension. Pouch is super easy to download and pin to your browser. It only takes a couple of clicks. To start using Pouch, all you have to do is click the link in the description, click Add to Chrome, pin to your browser and Pouch will do all the work for you. So if you guys want to start using Pouch when you next shop online, click the link in the description and start using Pouch for free. We have not one big parcel, not two big parcel, but three huge pretty little thing parcels. Let's open up the bag and see what's inside. So the first item of clothing I have already fallen in love with. It is a sweatshirt and it's a brown material. It's oversized. I picked this up in a small and on the front it says Wyoming. This jumper is so oversized but it seems like it's gonna be a really comfy jumper. It's like a fluffy but thin material inside so this will be good for the spring season that is coming up. I'm absolutely loving the browns at the moment as I'm sure a lot of people are because I have seen it all over my Instagram feed. I'm definitely loving this style sweatshirt at the moment and I can't wait to pair this. I think it'll go really nice with some blue jeans, but I will try it on for you guys and we can see what it looks like on. So the price of this sweatshirt before the discount codes were put into place was in fact 22 pounds. I don't think that's too bad for a sweatshirt. It's definitely a little bit more than what I would usually spend on a sweatshirt, but it is a very stylish sweatshirt and you can definitely dress it up or dress it down. So the next item I actually picked up was a co-ord. Now I am really surprised by the quality of this co-ord. I was a little bit skeptical to pick it up as I was scared that it was going to be a see-through material, it was going to be thin and it was going to be one of them materials that kind of just sticks to you and is really unflattering. However, the material of this co-ord is so lovely and thick. So the co-ord is basically just this little, which can I just say guys, looks absolutely tiny. So I don't know if this is gonna fit me, but we have this, <laughs> it's tiny. It is so small and dainty as well. So we have this little triangle bralette type thing. This is a knitted material, but it's a really thick knitted material. It is in like a nude color, like a light nude color. I don't think this would offer much support to anyone that has big boobs. It's a lovely little top, definitely for the summertime. I can imagine this in summer with some shorts or even with the leggings that it comes with, but that is the top to the co-ord. Now the bottoms to the co-ord is actually, I think it's just a pair of leggings. Oh, that's a nice surprise. So it is some leggings, they are so 
thick. Again, I was so worried about these because one thing I hate is see-through leggings. Now, these are knitted leggings, just the same material, the same colour as the top. However, it has a split hem in the bottom. I think that is such a lovely feature to put on a pair of leggings because that means that you can wear this as casual wear or you can also dress it up with some heels and a blazer and I'm sure it would look lovely. I actually picked this up in a size small. Now, the only bad thing about this cord is that you can't change the sizing of the top and the bottoms. So, this cord, let me just check the price on this cord. With the quality of this material, and the just loveliness of the cord. This was £28. I think that's so fab for a outfit. But yeah, I'm actually really pleased with this. For the money and the quality of the products, I'm really, really happy with it. But we'll see what it looks like on. Guys, I'm so sorry because I genuinely really want to show you this, but it's just not, it's just see-through. Why is it see-through when it's such thick material? Oh, it's so lovely as well. I think if you wear this with nude, like, seamless pants, you'll be fine. Okay, so the next product I have is a sports bra. Now, I'm pretty sure this is part of a two-piece set, just like the last one that I showed you guys. So, this is a sports bra, and wow, the thickness and the quality of this is absolutely amazing. It is so, like... I don't know what the word is, like strong. Is that even a t is that is that even a term for an item of clothing? And another thing I like about it is you can adjust the strap. Sometimes I find with sports bras they can either be a little bit too tight around the armpit area, and that makes them really hard to get off, especially when you've just done a workout. It's like sage green khaki. It's not like a dark green, but it is a like a khaki green that even makes sense but as well there's a little bit of detailing around the bust area which I'm sure is very flattering I picked this up in a small I can't wait to find the leggings to go with this and then I can show you guys this on so this sports bra was 12 pounds I think that's amazing for a sports bra. Now, don't get me wrong, I've had sports bras from Primark before and they've been four pounds. However, the quality of this, you can tell why it's 12 pounds. It's so thick and supportive and it also, I've got to mention, does have padding. So yeah, this is definitely worth 12 pounds, but we'll see what it looks like on. So the last thing that I have in my first PLT bag is the item that actually persuaded me to do this video. It didn't take much persuading, however, this two-piece really drew me in. So, I don't actually have the joggers as of yet, they will be in another bag, but this is the hoodie. Now, the material, I, I literally, I can't even get over how good the quality is. Again, it's this really strong elastic on the cuff on the arms, and there's also a cuff on the bottom, so it's a cropped jumper. The one thing I like about it is it's really different in the sense that it kind of, I don't know how to explain, but it's like high neck but it's a hoodie. I don't know if that makes sense. It definitely looked lovely on the model, so I just had to pick it up, and it just says pretty little thing, and it's embroidered in. I picked this up in a small. So this was 20 pounds, and the bottoms were 20 pounds, so altogether the set was 40 pounds, which I don't think's that bad for a two-piece set, especially of, again, this quality. I know I'm saying it all of the time, but honestly, I'm really amazed by it. But yeah, I absolutely love this, and I can't wait to unwrap the bottoms, because if the bottoms are as good quality as the top, I will definitely definitely be living in this. Okay everyone, I am moving on to the next bag which is really exciting. I'm pretty sure the bottoms to the two pieces will be in here. I've actually kind of forgot what I've bought. What is this? Oh, I forgot about that. Now, these, wow. Whoa, okay. This is what I've been looking for. Why it takes me so long to find a set of gym leggings, I do not know, but they have to have certain features. These leggings have those features. So we have the bottoms to the, let me find it, parky sports bra that I just showed you guys. And these leggings are so thick. And let me talk you through how stunning these leggings are. Not only at the bottom do you have this really cute scrunching effect, the bottoms to the ankles are really tight. This might sound really strange, but my gym leggings have to be super tight because I hate baggy leggings. They also are ribbed and thick and the waistband is tight. And just to top it all off, scrunching at the bum. 
perfect, perfect gym leggings. They have like detailing all throughout the leggings and they are so stunning. I'm so excited to try this on and I just think it's gonna look absolutely lovely. I did pick these up in a small. They definitely look fine size wise because some gym leggings do come and they're absolutely tiny. They do look fine size wise. Now these were 20 pounds which makes the whole set 33 pounds I think. I really really like these. I'm definitely gonna be wearing them all the time to go on my walks. Everyone this is gonna be the quickest show in your whole entire life because I haven't fit tanned and quite honestly, I think this doesn't look great on me. It's not a very flattering colour, it's also a little bit see-through. I don't know if that's the kind of pants I'm wearing. So the next thing I have to show you guys is actually the bottoms to the hoodie and yeah, they've just done so well with this collection. They are so thick and the cuffs are so like tight and they have pockets. I know that sounds weird as well because most joggers do have pockets but I've had joggers without pockets before. They are really lovely. They do look a little bit big. I don't know what size I got. What size do I get? Oh, I got an extra small so maybe they're not. Maybe they just look big and they'll not be big on. They have the PLT logo on and these were, well I told you guys they were £20 so the whole set was 40 I'm guessing this is going to look really really nice on and I can't wait to show you guys so we will wait till I try it on to see what that looks like together. Just a quick one guys because I know you want to hear my feedback. I am definitely 100% keeping this because it is stunning. It is the comfiest tracksuit I think I've ever worn in my life and it is so flattering. I usually look like a potato in a tracksuit. No potatoes around here. So the next thing I have to show you guys is a very, very staple piece in my wardrobe, but I don't have enough of them. It is a jumpsuit and not only is it a jumpsuit, it is a high neck long sleeved, zip up, long legged black jumpsuit. Now, these are my saviors for if I am not feeling myself, I haven't fit tanned, I haven't shaved my legs. This is the perfect outfit. I have worn these everywhere. I wear them to the shops, I wear them out on nights out. They look so nice with a belt on some boots and some heels and a blazer. But yeah, this is a lovely cat. Do they call them catsuits? I think they call them catsuits. But yeah, it's got a zip on it. It's a lovely thick material. Again, I was a little bit worried about this because I'm a little bit scared it might be see-through. But by the looks of it, it doesn't look like it is gonna be see-through. And again, it's just a really thick and stretchy material. I'm honestly really amazed by the quality of these products. And now I understand why I spent a little bit more than I should have on these products. But yeah, I absolutely love this. There's nothing much really I can say about this other than I got it in a size. Oh, I got it in a size four. Oh, I don't know why I did that, that it might not fit me. So this was £25, which when you think about it, it is a lot because it is just like legging material and it is just like a plain black catsuit. However, again, you're getting a full outfit for £25. And not only that, it's an outfit that you can wear around the house, to the shops, on a day out, on a night out. It's just a all in all great outfit. But yeah, I definitely love this and I can't wait to wear this on my food shop to Asda because I don't really have anywhere else to wear it. Wow. Really quickly, just gonna point out, what? it has thumb holes. I'm now officially Catwoman and I feel absolutely amazing. I am ready for the day, even though it is seven o'clock at night. Oh, I look like I'm doing that slow-mo thing on TikTok. Now, I am so excited for this next product. I completely forgot about it. I don't know how I completely forgot about it because it is such an exciting product. Why have these come back into fashion? Who knows? I had a red Hollister one when I was in school, but you know what? These are even better. Look at this. It is a nude thick. Is it even suede? I don't know what it is, but it's like a like a matte material gilet or body warmer. I don't know which one you call it. This is stunning. Do you know what it kind of looks like? It kind of looks like horse riding ones. And I, I like horse riding, so we're just gonna roll with it. I saw this and I was a little bit skeptical about getting it because me and Lee, ha <laughs> this sounds really sad, but me and Lee share a gilet that we bought together because we both wanted it and there was no point in buying two. So we share it. However, this is such nice quality than the one that I have and it's so 
thick. I have just come up with the best outfit idea ever. This, the catsuit and the boots that I'm about to show you are gonna go amazing. So yeah, it's just a popper one and then it's got like drawstrings in the middle to pull it tight and it is so lovely. I picked this up in a, I picked this up in a four again. I don't know what's wrong with me guys. I think it's because it looked a little bit oversized and I like my gilets to be tight. This was, let me just check. So this was, sorry, £25 for a gilet. Guys, I'm a little bit too giddy. Like, I didn't think I'd like everything this much. I love this. And do you know what? Pulling that in, cinching the waist. I'm going to have this, my catsuit, my boots, a hat. I'm going to look absolutely fabulous on my walk. But yeah, I love this and I love the colour of it. It's so lovely. It's like a, kind of like a greeny beige. But yeah, I can't wait to wear this. And it's going to look so nice with that jumpsuit. Can we all just take a moment for the gilet? Wow! Or for my hike? This is rude. How can a gilet be this nice? Oh, I'm so excited! Guys, so what? How it? I'm literally mind blown. I'm a little bit confused as to how I'm going to show you this on camera because this next item is absolutely massive. It is a, what are these even called? Like a trench coat. It is a khaki slash nude. Is that even a nude? It's like a greeny colour trench coat. It is huge. I'm pretty sure I picked this up in a four, you know. I did. I picked it up in a four. What? It's absolutely massive. Probably will look right on, but I am a very short person. So if this goes down to the floor, then it is definitely going back. But yeah, I was... I saw this and I was absolutely obsessed with it. I've wanted a trench coat for absolute ages. I've just put off buying one. I don't know why. It's just because I own so many coats. However, when I saw this and I was doing this video, it was just an excuse to get it, wasn't it? So yeah, I got this. I got it in a four, as I just said. Oh, it says, take good care of me. Colour may run. Yeah, I got this in a four and I'm pretty certain this was £45, guys. Which, when you think about it, is still cheap because if you were to go in Primark, they'd be 30 to £35. So it's not even that expensive when you think about it. And again, I sound like a broken record but the quality is great i'm not too sure whether it would be waterproof or not but yeah it's lovely and the details on it is so lovely so like the buttons and there's like this little strap but yeah i think this is a try on moment i don't think i can make, give this any justice holding it up like this but it looked lovely on the model and molly so there it is and we'll try it on now oh she just doesn't do it for me she just didn't do it guys. This coat just did not do it for me. Ah. Oh. So sad about this guys. I actually am because it's a gorgeous coat. But it's just the fitting. Oh, it's because I'm so small. I do like it. It's lovely quality. As you guys can see, I didn't actually show you on the video that it has these kind of cuffs. Very lovely detail. Really lovely coat. Not good for short people. Okay, guys, we are on to the last box and I'm pretty certain this is the final item and I'm so excited for this. I'm pretty sure these were on the PLT website before the Molly May collab. They were in her collab section, so I picked them up because I was a little bit confused. Surely they're part of the... I don't even know, but yeah. They were in the club. These are the dupes for the Zara boots. I was a little bit worried because in the photo, they did look a little bit... They did look a little bit scrunched at the ankle. However, they do feel like a really thick material. So, let me get one out for you. Hi everyone, meet my new child. These are the dupes for the Zara boots that everyone seems to be wearing. I did actually pick these up in a five. Now I am a six usually, however, they still look huge. So I'm glad I picked them up in a five. How beautiful are they? Like how beautiful are they? I know that you think they're beautiful. I'm pretty sure these were 45 pound guys, let me check. Yeah, so these were 45 pounds and I'm pretty certain they're not that much more expensive from Zara. However, I used my pouch code and I got money off these. So, win-win really, isn't it? We have the Zara Duke boots. I'm not going to get the other out because they are both absolutely huge. Can you just imagine the jumpsuit, the boots, the gilet? Can you imagine that as an outfit? Because I can. And I'm dreaming. I love these. The quality of everything in this collab has been so, so good. And I'm so, what's the word? Pleasantly surprised by that because I was a little bit worried. Let's try these on and see what they look like on. Okay, everyone. So these are the boots on. I'm pretty sure I'd have to wear another pair of socks. As you guys can see, it is like a little bit but apart from that I absolutely love them and I'm so glad I got them in a five because they fit perfectly so if you're gonna get these definitely 
thighs down, one size. But yeah, apart from that, they're really, really lovely boots. So everyone, that is it for the PLT haul. I have enjoyed it so much and I have definitely stepped out of my comfort zone with some of these outfits. This whole collection, I can't even say, a, I don't even think I can say a bad word about it because everything has been such great quality, such great colours, so on trend. Obviously, I'm not speaking for the whole collection because I don't have the whole collection. I'm pretty sure the standard of the quality will remain throughout everything. If you guys have enjoyed this video, make sure you go down below and leave a like and also don't forget to leave a comment. I love having a chat with you guys in the comment section also don't forget to subscribe and head over and follow my instagram thank you so much for watching guys i really really hope that you all enjoyed this video and i will see you all very soon in my next video bye guys Ooh.